This is the greatest response I've seen a developer give a negative Steam review, and I was fortunate enough that it happened to my own friend. We play a lot of climbing games similar to Only Up, and this one was called Bunny Guys. These games always get salty, but that's kind of normal for us, and we just tend to power through it for hours. Come on, you little bunny bastard! C Fuck! Fuck you! Fuck you! No, oh, come the fuck on! You fucking dick! Do you want to see a 2 guy? No, what the fuck? Oh, come on! However, we weren't aware of a mechanic in the game that basically made them a bit saltier than normal. Is this the end? Kai, I think, did you do it? I think I've done it, boys! I've got the go the cat! Yeah, boy! I'm at... I'm at... Oh, over? Oh, no! Oh, no! 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 Since when was it a race? Oh my god, that is fucking savage. So, after talking Rob into continuing again from the beginning, eventually, this happened. Katar's off Spenny, though. I'm out. Yeah, I got one. Alright, what happened, Rob? Oh, you fucking alt there, Ford. And pipes are the most ridiculous thing in the game. They don't get it. Rob, you didn't even Me. fucking make it to the pipe. Rob, you was were nowhere it? near that pipe. You fucking whiffed it. I quite remember that halfway through that I got reset and I lost like two three hours worth of progress. Like, I'll tell you what. Rob, you know everyone who sees that review is just gonna laugh at you, right? This is a rage game. And people just make fun of bad reviews like this. Memes aside, what did Rob actually say? Game is tedious and boring. You get to checkpoint 5 and every fall takes ages for the death animation. And if you fall, you have to do the rocks that take forever to come up and down. The pipe system is poor. For example, in Only Up, you could vault up and continue. This game forces you to make jumps up and across with the potential of poor grabbing system not working and an easy fall. Many better games that won't force you have things such as axes kill you when you're nowhere near them as well. Wait, what? Personally, I would avoid you. I didn't know Rob made this review and it could have just ended there. Until the next day when I was playing Baldur's Gate 3, Rob came into my chat and informed me that the developer had responded. The game dev was in my chat when I was trashing the game last night after finished. <laughs> oh my god. And I wrote a stinker review. Rob! For fuck's sake! It's a good it's good though. Game is tedious and boring. Well, personally, I would avoid. Let's see what the developer said. He said, I'm truly sorry to hear that the game didn't quite live up to your expectations. I followed you to a stream and can understand how frustrating it can be to fall repeatedly. It's important to emphasize that such challenges are deliberately built into the gameplay to maintain tension. As you noticed, your two teammates actually made it to the top, which first shows the patience and skill are crucial. In longer rounds of play, this problem could be compounded as concentration can wane. Repeating mistakes in the same place can cause frustration, which in turn could lead to more mistakes. I appreciate players who provide feedback, ideas, and suggestions to improve the game experience. If you have any questions or suggestions, please don't hesitate to contact me. Also, I'd like to thank you with your friends for reducing my game to other users and playing it together. Thanks again, and we wish you can, uh, continued fun. Oh my god, Rob, you just got fucking smoked, mate. Holy shit. That response couldn't have been any more perfectly written. Not only was it professional, but essentially just said to him, Get good, mate. I just love the bit where he's like, Oh, well, your two friends completed it. And as you can see, skill and patience are required. <laughs> <laughs> Not long after, I've kept him anonymous, but a guy with a very nice bum that definitely wasn't me left a review telling Rob that he was wrong. He actually thought it was quite funny that the dev absolutely smoked him. So, um, yeah, don't be a dick to Rob. It's just a fun video, you know? Seeing your mate write a bad review and get absolutely shut the fuck down. <laughs> Uh, I fucking love Rob, man. Also, I just noticed I got 704 games in my Steam account. <laughs> Dude, in, I think it was like 2013, we like took the piss out of Sam for having 300 games in his account and never pay, playing them. Whoops. In my defense though, shit show Sunday, right? <laughs> but if anyone has more games in their account, let me know. So yeah, if you want to play the game, it's on Steam right now for less than a tenner. It's called Bunny Guys. Uh, I beat the game in 2 hours and 20 minutes. If you could beat me, let me know. Later.